Hello everyone, in this video we will see how to design and implement a binary to grey code converter using a suitable decoder. So these are the binary inputs. So by, uh, we are uh, converting 4 bit binary to 4 bit grey code. So the binary inputs are shown over here and the output is G3, G2, G1, G0. So you know uh, how to convert from binary to grey. So we will write the corresponding grey codes for this. So first one is 0, 0, 0, 0. Next one is the 0 changes to 1. So 0, 0, 0, 1. Now we will write the mirror image of this. So we will write 1 over here and 0 over here. Here we will put 1s. Then these are zeros. Now we will write the mirror image of this 4 cells over here in the next 4 cells. That is 1, 0, 1, 1, 0, 1. 0 0 now we will append 1s over here these are zeros now in the next 8 cells we will write the mirror image of this 8 in the next 8 cells so we can write here it is 1 0 0 so I will write 1 0 0 over here 1 0 1 1 1 1 1 1 0 0 1 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 0 0 0 and we will append 1 over here so this are the corresponding grey codes so this is the binary codes for 4 bits from 0 to 15 and this is the corresponding grey code now we can implement this using a decoder so since there are 4 inputs we have to use a 4 by 16 decoder and now let us write the expressions for the outputs g3 g2 g1 and g0 in sop form so we can write g3 as so g3 uh, so we are writing the sop form so we'll write the min terms corresponding to output 1 so the output is 1 corresponding to 8 to 15 so we will write g3 is equal to sigma m 8 9 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 and 15. So this is G3. Now next we will write G2. So G2 is high corresponding to 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 and 11. So that is G2. Next is G1. So the expression for G1 is G1 is high for 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 11, 12 and 30. So that is G1 and finally G0. G0 is high corresponding to 1, 2, 5, 6, 9, 10, 13, 14. So now we can implement this using a 4 by 16 decoder. So let this be our 4 by 16 decoder. So the inputs of the decoder are A, B, C, D and the outputs we can write as D0 to D15. Output is D0. So we have drawn the 4 by 16 decoder. Now we can 
uh, implement the output G3. So G3 is 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 14 and 15 so all this can be given to an so this outputs that is g3 is sigma 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 so we have taken those outputs and we have given to an or gate so that this becomes equal to this is output g3 so since this is an sop function implementation and here we have considered the decoder output as active high it is not specified in the question so we can take it as active high or active low so i have taken it as active high so corresponding to a particular combination if 0, 0, 0, 0001 comes at the output uh, the, then d1 will be high if 1000 0, 0, 0, that is corresponding to 8 1000 0, 0, 0 comes at the input then d8 will be high so if any of the input is high then the output should be high since it is an sop form so we can use an or gate so we have connected it to a or gate So that is the expression for G3. Now the expression for G2 was 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So we can give that to another OR gate 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So we can give this as input of another OR gate and that will be equal to G2. So we have implemented G2. Now we will take G1. G1 is 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13. So it is 2, 2, 3, 4, this is 4, this is 5, 2, 3, 4, 5, 10, 11, 12, 13. This is 10, this is 11, this is 12, and this is 13. So we are going giving that to another OR gate. So that is G1, and finally we have to show G0, that is 1, 2, 5, 6, 9, 10, 13, 14. So 1. 2, 5, 6, 9, 10, 13, 14. This is 9, 10, 13, and 14. So we can give this to another OR gate and this will be equal to G0. So we have implemented a two, uh, implemented a binary to grey code converter using a 4x16 decoder with the output of the decoder as active high. So let us consider a, a binary number at the input. So let us consider this example that is we are going to give 0, 1, 0, 1 at the input so we are going to give 0, 1, 0, 1 at the input so correspondingly let us check so 0, 1, 0, 1 is 5 
so d5 in g1 in the expression for g1 d5 is there so it will be 1 in the expression for g2 d5 is there so it will be 1 in the expression for g3 g3 d5 is not there so it will be 0 and in the expression for g0 d5 is there so it will be also 1 so correspondingly we will get the code as 0 1 1 1 g3 g2 g1 and g0 so g3 will be low g2 g1 and g0 will be high so let us check that over here so corresponding to 0 1 0 1 we'll get g3 as 0 g2 g1 g0 as 1s so that we have got over here so we have converted the binary at the input to gray code at the output using a 4x16 decoder that's all for this video thank you now if you need uh, you can implement this using a decoder with active low output also for that you have to implement this using instead of or gates you have to give nand gates that's all thank you